the session for today is all about Facebook advertising. And so I've got uh, my right hand gal, Valerie Schutman, on the line. What's going on, Val? Hey, what's up, Nick? <laughs> hey, Glad hey. to be here and live. Glad to be here. Glad to be here live. So, um, so what we're going to do is we're going to dive into uh, some really awesome content. So I'm just going to flip over actually to uh, my PowerPoint, do a little screen share. And so we got some great slides put together. And you guys should all see our slides right now. And the slides breaks down some really awesome content about Facebook advertising and marketing. And so what we're going to do is we're going to walk through everything from, you know, what is Facebook advertising, why you should, you know, be a part of it right now and what the opportunity is. And then we're going to give you some steps on how to actually run Facebook ads and optimize. And Valerie's going to walk through and do a, a 10 minute presentation and literally build an ad in 10 minutes to show you guys that it doesn't have to be really difficult or challenging to to create and optimize your Facebook ad. So, and the cool thing is that if you're new to Facebook advertising, there's so much that we learn along the way and there's so much from a strategy standpoint that I learn each and every single day that Valerie with optimizing the ads each and every single day, there's so much learning curve that we can cut off for you and that's what we're going to do here. And so um, before we dive into the actual you know, content, I just want to also just make sure everyone's aware. Uh, we worked really, really hard to create the businessonfirebundle.com. And that is the spirit of the Life on Fire Virtual Summit. We've got entrepreneurs that donated and they put in their, their courses that they sell for hundreds, if not thousands of dollars in some cases. And all those courses came together for the Business on Fire bundle. And the sweet thing is that the proceeds goes to build a school in Guatemala. So if you were on the last session of the Life on Fire Virtual Summit, you heard from Adam Braun, who started that organization. It's so freaking incredible. And so you know what we're doing is we're having that price go from $97, and it's increasing to $197. So we just really want to encourage you, if you've been thinking about it, grab that Business on Fire bundle and help us build a school in Guatemala. We're going to be sharing that journey with you too. So you can do that by going to Business on Fire bundle maybe just jot that down as something that you can do you know after this session so here's what we're going to go through today so Valerie and I we're going to um, we're going to break down how that you can build authority and attract your ideal clients with Facebook marketing, how that you can actually build a fi what's called a Facebook marketing funnel that converts, and how to drive targeted likes to your page for 20 cents or less that are, that are targeted. You know, it's not folks, you know, in remote, desolate areas in the world. I mean, you're talking real targeted likes so that you can have you know, um, leads on your page that you can ultimately get to convert to email opt-ins and ultimately have to be, uh, you know, uh, paying customers as well. So from there, we're going to talk about how to get email opt-ins. Every single business absolutely needs to have um, an email list. And this is one of these things where you know, if you have an email list, you have a network. If you've got a network, then you can guide that network and you can share your products and services, make sales. So it is the, the foundation of an online business is having that email list. So that is super important. And the great thing is with Facebook ads, I mean, how nice is it that if you're like, you know what, Nick, I'd like to grow my email list by a thousand people in November. And you know what? If it's two, if we know your math and we know that it's two bucks to get an email opt-in, well, awesome. Then all you have to do is run Facebook ads, and you can drive traffic to build up your email list, and that can happen in days or in weeks. It doesn't have to take years, you know. So it's a really great way to be able to build up your email list, your influence, and your cash flow. So we're going to talk through some case studies too, and how um, there's been over 1,100% return on investment, and that's the beauty of Facebook ads is that. You know, if you can put in a dollar and get back more than a dollar um, in profit, that is what's key. And so that's the that to me, that's the holy grail in marketing is for every buck that you put into Facebook ads, if you can get two back, you are in good shape. So, um, you know, so one of the things I think is really important is to actually think about our why behind why, why are we doing all of this, you know, and so we've got some great sessions that are going to drill down into purpose and into why on the virtual summit, but just so that you guys have some context just around around me and, and, and who the heck I am, if, you know, if this is the first time you're ever hearing my voice or the first time you're ever seeing uh, me live or presenting, and I think it's going to lay some good context for the virtual summit, but the other thing is that um, I, I'm going to be sharing my journey, but it's very, very important to know that how I share this 
is in a way of teaching you what has happened and how I not only discovered Facebook marketing, but how I leveraged it to build my businesses. And so the key thing is to really make sure that, that uh, we keep in the frame of mind that it has nothing to do with just me sharing my story or just you know trying to toot my own horn with what I've accomplished. This is really about, check out this journey. Look how fast things have grown. Look how fast things have happened in my life because of this one strategy with Facebook ads. And that's when you really see how quickly these things came together, it, it starts to provide some context and say, man, if in just, you know, 90 days, look what Nick did with Facebook ads, what could I do in, in 30 days or 60 days or 120 days, you know? So, um, but at the very beginning, I think it's important to think back about the why. So, you know, for me, it was as a kid, I just always, always was on a mission and I just wanted to love what I did for work. I wanted to just find my purpose. I wanted to have passion. You know, I looked at those around me and, and people were too too busy and everyone, you know, was working nights and weekends and, you know, weren't able to go to my football games or weren't able to do other things. And I, you know, resented that, you know, and, and as, as a kid, I didn't know. I didn't know any better. And, you know, really it was just... If I, if I look back, you know, there were people in my life that had settled and their jobs owned them and they, and they didn't like their bosses and they, um, and they took their work home with them and were stressed out. And I just said, man, I, I just don't ever want to be like that. And so as a little kid, I just decided I always wanted to um, live what I call a life on fire. I want to love what I do for work, work with great people and, um, and you know, be able to help people give back along the way. And so through my journey, you know, since I've pretty much always been an entrepreneur since I was a kid, and through that journey, I've had lots of bumps and bruises, <laughs> much like today, um, a little bump and a little bruise with the, the server. Um, but I want to start, you know, and pick up in my part of my journey with um, a business called the New Perks Card. And so what's interesting about this is I, you know, went from chasing, you know, money in real estate. I went from doing network marketing. I was always chasing, chasing money. And then I finally get back to Connecticut and I had this great concept of selling a card that was 20 bucks and on the card I had discounts to local businesses. So if you had my new perks card in your hand and it was a physical card that folded like an accordion and had all these discounts on it, if you walked into a restaurant, you could get half off a bottle of wine. You could walk into another restaurant and get a free appetizer on Tuesdays, right? So I created this really cool concept that that had discounts, you know, for consumers to walk into local businesses. So it was cool for consumers. It was great for business owners. But the kicker was that when you bought the card for 20 bucks, half the money went to charity. And so I had some big nonprofits on board, and this was really one of my, quote, four purpose businesses. You know, in the last session, you heard Adam Braun talk about four purpose. Well, in this case, I had this four purpose business, and this was back in 2008, and it was going incredibly well. Things were awesome, and, and um, oh, and Val, Val, are you seeing this? There's an audio. Audio, okay? No, your audio's uh, really bad, actually. It's really, really? Yeah, it's echoing and uh, just all sorts of strange things. It actually sounds like you're maybe on Star Trek or something and muffled. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. All right. All right. Well, let's, uh, um, let me, let's me see if we can't, if we can't swap, swap that, out. that out. Hold on, hold on a second. One second. The, the audio, the audio and, and the tech problems will just, will just... They're, just, they're, they're just going to keep going. Keep going. Yeah, I've got, I've got, I've got another, mic another mic here, here just, in, just case. in case. So let me plug, plug, in. plug in. The tech gremlins are rampant today. All right. Let's try. Hey, that sounds better. All right. So how's this one? That is much better. Much better. Oh, my goodness. All right. So <laughs> that's crazy. All right. So we're going to go back to the prez. Boom. All right. And so, Val, you can see the screen okay? Yeah, I can see the screen just fine. All right. Perfect. And so your audio sounds better. All right, all right. Okay, well, cool. So, um, so basically, you know, there I was with with this really cool for purpose business. Business things were going great, and you know, this was one of the first, you know, you know, hits I had in business, and it was going so well. And you know, and the next step was, you know, all these business owners said, Nick, now that it's going so well, you should take the next step. You should really hire an advertising company. And I was like, okay, yeah, I'm totally open to that. You know, went in there, sit down with them. I had a 10-page marketing plan, and they took it and literally threw it in the garbage. I mean, imagine, you know, walking into a meeting with your 
marketing plan that was working and then they literally threw it in the garbage and they said Nick you need to do TV commercials and I was just shocked I was like you know this is you know 2008 and I was like TV commercials really and I'm like aren't they expensive and you know they came back and said listen you know that is how you can get traffic to your site that is how you can get customers you know we're an you're, you know we're a big large advertising agency we've been doing this for literally a hundred years and we have your best interest in mind and so at that point I said you know what maybe I have to get out of my own way maybe I, sh I should trust these guys so I did so I ended up investing you know money that I had I put some on credit card I put everything I had into it and it was about thirty thousand bucks and after the first week ten thousand of dollars burned through plus ten thousand dollars to create an animated commercial um, I ended up with one card sale after the first week and it was and it came in with a check and I was just absolutely floored it was devastating and and I look back and I was like you know I was freaking out I ended up you know still burning through another ten thousand dollars because I couldn't stop it in time so after thirty thousand bucks I I ended up selling fourteen cards which was two hundred and eighty dollars so I put in thirty grand and I made back two hundred and eighty that re that is such a negative return on investment it was awful I mean it put me in really tough you know in in a, in a really tough spot with the business ended up just really just just ruining the whole thing and and so I had and the takeaway is that if you think about TV commercials, who are you marketing to? It's broad. I you can't control is who's plunked down in front of that TV, you know, and you could only control the channel that it was on. And it advertised to the to the entire state of Connecticut. Well, my my card was only good in one town, and so you can see the big takeaway is that that was untargeted. And from that situation, you know, I got you know all these lemons in my hand, right? And instead of you know letting that you know take me out of the game or you know quitting I said you know what what's what's the next thing how can I find a win out of this how can I find a solution I said you know what that became my mission to find a better way that became my mission to say you know what I need to learn how to advertise and earn a profit instead of losing everything because I feel like you know I could help a lot of people so it was at that very moment where I then decided to um, just start investing my way out of it. You know, I spent another twenty thousand bucks on credit cards. I started buying courses. I started learning about Facebook marketing and advertising. I went to an event called a Mastermind out in L.A. and I was so, um, you know, I was in such debt that I mean, I went to this Mastermind and I put two. Uh, two thousand five hundred dollars on my discover card and I had to have a friend pay the other half um, and she was my guest and we went there together and I had to go there with protein mix in a sandwich bag I mean it was totally crazy that um, I just I, I literally didn't have any money and I just found a way I got it done I got to this event and a few things happened number one I put myself in an environment around people that knew how to market knew how to market online uh, number two is that I learned some incredibly important techniques and things I'm going to share with you here today. You know, I learned how to drill down my target market. I learned how to become a marketing expert. I learned all kinds of skills, and that happened because of the investment that I made and because of surrounding myself with the right people. And so, you know, so I basically I had the business that failed that created my purpose. I then took that purpose and then went head first into learning a better way with Facebook advertising. So there I was. You know, I had to cover 3,500 bucks to cover my bills, and I was out of cash. I was credit card debt racked up, 50 grand in debt, and I made that decision. And so, oftentimes, as entrepreneurs, that's what we have to do. We have to just draw a line in the sand, and you've got to make that conscious decision to change. So, wherever that point may be, you know, if I was 3,500 bucks in debt, or maybe if you've had a time in your life where you were up against a wall, or maybe you're working at a, a job or a company that you don't like, we all have to do that. We we all have to just draw that line and say, you know, what, I'm making a decision. In my case, I decided to choose a niche, and that is one of the key aspects with Facebook marketing: is drilling down and really having a niche that you can dominate. So, I decided to become a Facebook marketing expert that day, and I figured I was just going to, you know, master it and just become the best at it. And so, drill down, use courses. And I just started charging people a couple hundred bucks. I started charging people a few hundred dollars. And the better the results that I got people, the more that I could charge. And that's the whole thing is that your income is directly proportional to the results that you get people. If you can get people, um, you know, if, if 
if I could help you make ten thousand dollars by doing a Facebook marketing campaign well what's that worth that might be worth five thousand or six thousand now if I could take someone and we've got a great example of you know helping a woman make an additional one of our clients make an additional million dollars in one year because of Facebook advertising well what is that worth you know thirty six thousand bucks shoot that's worth like a couple hundred thousand dollars so it all is about getting results for people and that's what I love about Facebook ads is that you can put in money and you can know how much money you're gonna make back in a very short period of time and so from that situation personal brand came in and personal brand is very important because um, you know, in my case, I mean, this was me taking a, a photo. I painted my dining room wall blue. I mean, this was totally bootstrapped. But what we've proven is that when you're running Facebook ads or even interacting on Facebook, a personal brand is going to have more pull and it's going to be easier to get off the ground than a company. And even if you do have a company brand, you know, now that we have life on fire, you really still need to have that personal personality behind it because it's just harder to interact with a logo. It's harder to interact with a faceless corporation. They're on Facebook. They want to interact. They want to build connection and know the person. So if you are a consultant, a marketing expert, um, a coach, having a personal brand is incredible on Facebook. And we've proven that a, uh, a personal brand um, is actually going to save you money on your advertising as well. So we've got one cool example of we ran the exact same um, ads and we ran it to the Nick Unsworth Facebook business page and we're getting email opt-ins for $2. We ran it to the, the Life on Fire Facebook business page we're getting email opt-ins for $2.60. So it's really interesting the impact of personal brand. So another key aspect is once you get rolling into Facebook advertising I brought in you know, I pounded the pavement. I started locally, and I and I got local clients. And then from there, um, I decided to start advertising. And so, what's crazy is that when I first started advertising, I only had a hundred dollars to invest. And so, if you think about kind of where I ended up, it went from being in debt. Oh crap! Moment. I need to make revenues. Learned a skill. Narrowed my niche. Went belly to belly. Got customers. Added value. You know made a couple bucks and then it was like alright I'm gonna reinvest a hundred dollars into my business with Facebook ads now check out what happened with this so by running Facebook ads I put a hundred dollars in and what I found is that there was one thing that just came natural well a lot of people were teaching to sell on Facebook and to sell on Facebook ads what I did was I just decided to be incredibly personal and personable and so I ran a Facebook ad that just said hey what do you think of my new Facebook page and what happened is it was just friendly and it was fun and people responded and they engaged and what happened is that that click-through rate so click-through rate means that the amount of people that click on your ad versus the amount of people that actually see it and when you have a high click-through rate what happens is Facebook rewards that behavior and so the more engaging your ads are the more that it's going to drive down your cost per click. And so what happened is that, you know, at this point you're talking 2010, um, when I ran that ad, it was very unique, very different. And my click through rate was so high that I was getting clicks for pennies. And because I was getting clicks for pennies, I was even getting email opt-ins for less than 50 cents. And so what was crazy is that I ran that ad, I got so much engagement, and I was able to stretch that $100 ad budget and I'm thinking this is pretty cool. This is all working, right? You know, all this training, all this stuff is paying off. It's working. And then all of a sudden, I get a phone call from a guy named Quincy, and you know, he's like, "I'd like to speak to Nick Unsworth." And I'm like, "Yeah, you know, you're this. This is him. You know, how can I help you?" And he was like, "Oh, wow. You know, I, I, I would have thought that I would have gotten your receptionist." <laughs> and I'm like, "Oh, you know, she's off right now. You know, just enjoying a long lunch." And and I'm thinking like, "What the heck is going on right now? Like, who is this guy?" And so Quincy is you know then he's like all right Nick so listen I you know I'm running a large technology conference in Honolulu called Technology News Bites and we would like you to be the keynote speaker and imagine if you think about this I was 30 days into this thing I invested a hundred bucks into my Facebook ads I was still you know had this looming fifty thousand dollars of debt I'm in this small second bedroom in my in my in my you know multi-family little little house and I'm thinking what the heck is happening like how on earth 
you know, why is this guy asking me to keynote at his event? And so I, you know, I said, so how'd you, how'd you, you know, hear about me? And he said, well, I saw what you were doing on Facebook. I saw your ads and we're incredibly impressed. And so of course I say yes. And then he says, all right, Nick, we'll send me your media kit. And I said, no problem, Quincy, I'll send it right over. And, and there I am, you know, I hang up the phone. I'm Googling what is a media kit. I had no idea. Right. But here, the reason I share that story is because, because guys, I mean, I had just gotten started and there I was getting this big opportunity to be a keynote speaker. Imagine how much that can would flip you out. And the reason I bring that up is because when someone advertises on Facebook, what happens is it creates brand positioning instantly. And when people see you all over Facebook and you're clear on what it is that you do, then people you're going to grow your mind share. And what happens is that people are going to perceive that you are the person for that topic. So if you advertise on Facebook and you advertise in a local market and you've got a restaurant, well, you know, your restaurant is going to get known. It's it's you can you can target so well on Facebook that you can build up that brand positioning fast. If you are, you know, a coach, consultant, an expert, then choose your niche. You know, it's you know, Valerie choosing her niche as a Facebook expert and then running ads and sharing her value on that. And so the cool thing is that it doesn't take years. It doesn't even take months. If you are consistent with Facebook advertising and you target the right way, which is what we're teaching here today, that you could build your brand positioning and literally go from new to being positioned as an expert. And it can happen fast. It doesn't happen have to take years. It's really incredible. And that's how fast it happened for me. And that's our goal for you is to build your brand positioning as well. So within 90 days, I just kept going and kept going. And, I, and granted, I was working, I was hustling. And, you know, I took the results I was getting for people and I started to charge more and more and more and more. So the more results I got for people, the more I charged. And, you know, I hit the 90 day mark. You know, I ended up getting a five figure contract with a large company, became their, you know, contracted social media director. I passed six figures. And that was 90 days of getting rolling. And, you know, that was incredible. That was life changing for me. Within two years, I had been able to build up that business and actually sell it within two years. So my life mission, when I was a little kid, it was like I always wanted to live that life on fire, had the big dreams, you know, wanted to sell a business by 30. That was my goal, and I did it. And the reason I did it was because I built up enough authority and I built up enough leads, a big enough email list, and enough revenues with Facebook ads that my biggest client, who I was the social media director for, um, they wanted more of my time. And they said, you know what, let's just buy this guy's business. You know, mul uh, multiple six-figure um, sale, let's just buy it and acquire him, uh, acquire him because, you know, we, we want him. We want him to stay on board. And so all that happened within two years. And so, I again, I bring that up because out of all the ways to market, You've got everything from phone sales, you know, networking and belly to belly sales. You've got live events. You've got, you know, marketing online with YouTube and podcasts and, and all these different channels. But the, the reason we're here today is because we're just so passionate that if you, you know, uh, are able to run ads on Facebook and you're able to. Um, bring in those leads and then you nurture them correctly and you sell and you learn how, how to sell correctly that it is com it is life-changing revenue it you know anyone can build their email list anyone can build their brand anyone can build that authority and it can happen really fast so it's super cool that you know you know to have this experience to have one of our clients to literally help her make an additional million dollars where she had never even broken the seven fig figure mark but when you look at the business and you come in and say, wow, if you had just, if you just use Facebook ad traffic to get you more leads, your infrastructure can support a seven-figure business, you're good to go. So super exciting. So the best decision ever made was focusing on Facebook advertising. You know, and what I love is that you can continue to run Facebook ads, create recurring revenue. It's the fast track to six figures. And you know, it's it's an incredibly leverageable skill that you can use. And ultimately, Facebook ads is going to help you increase profits. And if you do it right, you can get it to the point where you're reducing your hours worked. And you know, if you've got a business that is for purpose, then that to me is the full equation for a life on fire, where if you can make more money, work less, and then have purpose and help people, that to me is what it's about. So here's a couple case studies of what's possible. So, um, you know, so so Valerie and I worked with um, John Lee Dumas from Entrepreneur on Fire, who is on the summit. The guy is a 
uh, rock star with podcasting with one of the top shows in iTunes. And this is the point I want to make. $1,700 in for Facebook ads to pull back and make 14000 Like, how many times over would you do that, right? Imagine you take 1700 bucks and you put that in and you get 14000 back. I mean, those are that's math that I love. And so that's the goal with Facebook advertising is, you know, you put money in and you get more back. That's the whole point. Um, Kathy Wagner had never, ever done anything on Facebook advertising before. Um, she had not been selling on webinars, anything like that. And she did a launch and she was a little bit broken. Um, she openly shares the story, so um, it's okay for me to share it. And Kathy came to me and was was, you know, in a really tough emotional spot where she had been marketing her product, marketing her product, marketing it, and she does retail consulting for retail, retail businesses, and nothing's working, nothing's working, she kept saying, and, and I said, listen, let's take a deep breath, and let's do something that I've done hundreds and hundreds, if not thousands of times, and let's just run Facebook ads, and let's bring people to a webinar, and you know, at the end of that webinar, you're going to sell. And I helped her frame the whole thing out, helped her with the strategy, did out one-on-one -on -one hot seat, and here's what happened. She put in a little over $1,551 and made back 21000 bucks in revenue. And that was game-changing. That totally helped support her business and got her to carry through. So that was so key, 1500 bucks to make $21,000. Um, you've got Joe Polish. So Joe Polish is uh, a mentor of mine. Now I've joined his genius network. The guy's the man. Uh, he's, he's one of the most connected entrepreneurs literally in the world. Um, he's connected to, you know, major influencers. And um, and so this is something that, that Joe uh, just shared with us. And so, you know, Valerie and I, we didn't personally consult him on this, but we are working with him. And so with Joe, um, he did a promotion where he shared um, the videos from his annual event that people spent 10,000 bucks to go to, he put in $2,500 in Facebook ads and peeled back 60,000 in revenue. And that, it just those numbers, they're just staggering numbers, right? And so, now granted, these are, you know, these are success stories, right? You know, are there people that put in money and don't, and get a negative return? Absolutely. You know, my, my point of this isn't to um, to sugarcoat things. My point is that when you work with the right people, we get the right training, you can create an in absolutely incredible return on investment. So think about yourself right now. You put in, you know, a hundred bucks, you make back 300. You put in a thousand, you make back 5,000. In this case with Joey, put in 2,500, it made back 60,000. So Valerie and I were super excited um, because we've been, you know, consulting uh, Damon John from Shark Tank. So how many of you guys have seen Shark Tank? Um, if you haven't, it's an incredible show that is so good. And so we've gone in, and this is really interesting. You know, how do you build a relationship with a guy that is inaccessible? You, you can't just talk to him. You can't just get on the phone. You can't just hang out with the guy. He's so busy, and he's so successful that at that level, you, you just don't get access. So what we did was we said, hey, man, so... Um, what are you doing for online marketing? So my specialty and my team member, you know, Valerie's specialty is, is Facebook advertising. We'd love to come in and and add value. Let us let us consult you in one of your companies, and if we can drive down your lead costs, if we can make you more money, we're going to do it completely for free. So what ended up happening is that he looked at me, shook my hand, and said, thank you. Everyone comes up to me and pitches me. Everyone comes up to take from me. This is the first time since I can remember where someone's coming up to me to add value first. And you know what happened? You know, we came in, Val totally rocked it and, and taught their team some really cool stuff as far as Facebook advertising goes. And that built a relationship. So from there, you know, we're, we're, we're doing some business together. And, you know, this is in, in the point of this story is that when you learn a skill like Facebook advertising, it's not only allowing you to, you know, it's like the, you know, would you rather, um, it's like you're teaching the person how to fish and be self-sufficient. When you learn a skill like Facebook ads, you're becoming self-sufficient with your business. You can control your, your paycheck. You can control your destiny. But if you get really good at it, I mean, you can leverage that skill to add value for other influential people and get your foot in the door. So Valerie and I, I mean, we got our foot in the door with Damon John. You know, right now we're doing a huge launch with um, with Joe Polish, and that airs on November 20th. You know, if we don't have enough things going on, I mean, we looked at it and said, well, 
you know, Joe's doing this big promotion. Wouldn't it be great if we can help him on his Facebook ads just to build the relationship? So that is just a key takeaway is that, you know, once you learn this skill, you can help other people with it too and get your foot in the door and network up. So the overall high level benefits is that Facebook ads, it helps you to build your email list, creates that celebrity like brand positioning within your niche. And what would it be like where people think of you as the expert in your niche? You know, and that allows you to charge more, that allows you to have that, you know, people that are coming to you instead of feeling like you're always selling, selling, selling. You know, what I love about Facebook ads is it's an attraction model. People are clicking on your stuff, on your links, on your ads, and then they're coming to you. You're not out selling people, right? So, you know, wouldn't it be nice for you to have that celebrity like brand positioning? The next thing is being seen everywhere. You know, if you think about that concept of being seen everywhere, well, when someone logs into Facebook and they see your ads, that's awesome. Well, we now have the ability and we you know, are, are going to be teaching about remarketing where if they click on your ads in Facebook, wouldn't it be cool if that they then see those same ads on Pandora, on you know, the music station, on MSNBC, on major huge news sites all throughout the internet that literally follow the prospects around. So that's called remarketing that increases conversions and that is another great way to quote be seen everywhere. So um, from that likes if you have a page that has a lot of likes that creates social proof and then also increasing your revenue and income. So what we're going to do now is going to bust through some steps and how to get these things together and we're going to roll from there. So um, if you guys, uh, what I would love to do is if you guys have any questions, go to the chat, uh, the comments below and you can feel free to type any questions that you have there. We'll come back to them at the end and uh, definitely let us know any questions as we're going here. So, all right. So the number one first step is, is you've got to drill down on your ideal customer because Facebook allows you to, to target so narrowly that once you're clear on your ideal customer, it allows you to target your ads and, and really do that with like a surgeon-like precision. And so if you think back about when I advertised on TV, that was broad and I lost everything versus narrow with Facebook ads, you can have a much smaller budget and you can dominate in that market. So narrow your niche. Instead of being a business coach, it's a business coach that focuses on what? Instead of being a social media expert, I call myself a Facebook marketing expert. So drill down on age, on gender, and really important, what Facebook pages do they like? That is really, really key. You know, think about what are their challenges and frustrations. Now, if you think about advertising on Facebook, you know, you want to cater to what they need. And so a lot of times as marketers, we all, you know, we think we know what people want, we think we know what people need, but really we just need to ask them, you know, what is your biggest challenge and frustration? And if they say, you know, I need more leads, okay, cool. Well, here's a webinar on Facebook marketing. So you want to make sure that you're really clear and you know your customers well. Now, the benefits of being of having ideal customers is that they're more likely to give you referrals. They're not as price sensitive. Most importantly, they're fun to work with. And so when work's fun, money follows, and life is good. So you want to make sure that you're you're truly being um, you're truly being um, um, clear on exactly who you want as an ideal customer because what's funny is that after, you know by doing a lot of business coaching working working with a lot of clients what i find is a lot of times people choose their ideal customers based on who they work with now this is really big you want to like totally just listen you know listen closely and just really really take this piece in is that if you think about it who is your ideal customer is it who you've worked with in the past and you're just using that as your, your frame of reference, or are you deciding who is truly ideal for you? So for example, if you're a realtor and you look at it and say, well, my ideal customer is a first-time home buyer. Well, is that because, um, because who you currently work with and that's who you have access to? Or wouldn't it be ideal if your ideal customer was someone that you know, wants to buy a, a multi-million dollar house, right? They're two very different targets. And so when you're thinking about your ideal customer, you want to choose who really is ideal for you. And, and you want to be bold with that. So another example is we've got a client named Chatty, and he is a consultant, and he helps coach 
realtors. And so when I asked him this question, and we do our, our, our coaching programs, we do them live because we want to make sure that we can interact. We want to help people nail this stuff to ensure success. And so with Chatty, I was like, all right, man, so tell me about who your ideal customer is. And he's like, well, it's women who are realtors that are you know between 50 and, and 65 that are really struggling in their business, that they don't have... Um, uh, they're not tech savvy, and um, they're really frustrated. You know, things are tough, and I, and I'm also like, hold on, hold on. Is that ideal for you, or is that who you're currently working with? And there it was. That was the moment where all of a sudden he was like, you know what? That's who I'm currently working with. And I'm like, well, well, dude, who would you love to work with? That is ideal. And then he's like, oh, man, I'd love to work with someone, you know, with, with men that are 25 to 35 that are hungry, that are willing to do what I say, that are willing to pick up the phone and do cold calls and, and are tech savvy. And I said, Chatty, there you have it. That's your ideal target market. You need to run your ads. You need to create a webinar that caters to them. Forget you know, forget the you know the the women realtors, right? So, and this isn't about gender or anything. It's about what he is choosing and who he resonates with, right? So, when you're thinking about who your ideal target market is, is be bold, you know, and and really choose who you're going to have the most fun with. So, that was a huge exercise by doing that. You know, he's done five figures, you know, on his webinars since, and it's been a huge, huge, huge shift for him in his business. So, the next piece is that you need then need to look at and say all right you know why you need a facebook marketing funnel and so this is actually really simple and and if you think of if you're here right now most likely you may have come through this funnel but it's if you think of facebook and there's an ad on facebook and someone clicks on that well the next thing is that it brings you to what's called a lead capture page well i like to refer to it and valerie and i like to refer to it as a lead magnet so instead of it just saying you know click on this link and here's you know, an offer. Instead, it's you click on the link, and then we know what the challenge or frustration our target market has, and here's a solution. You know, for this very session here today, it's you know we're walking through Facebook advertising. You're going to know how to build an ad by the time that you're done. You're going to know the playbook that's working, that's generating five figures of result uh, of sales for clients. And you know what? And that is free content, it's completely free. But all the person has to do is enter their email to get access to it. So a lead magnet is nothing more than um, uh, an actual page that they put in their email in exchange for value, in exchange for a PDF. It could be in exchange for a live webinar, for a hangout, whatever that may be. So it attracts people to you. So it builds your email list, builds trust, allows you to follow up and convert sales. And uh, number three is now you got to just figure out, well, what is the best lead magnet for you? Now, there's absolutely no denying the fact that doing a live webinar is one of the most effective ways to make sales. And so when you run Facebook ads, they opt in for a live webinar or a live hangout like this, assuming that there are no tech challenges. And if you sell at the end, that is where the most efficient Facebook marketing funnel lies. And the reason webinars work so well is because you can hear the person's voice. When you hear their voice, you see their slides, you resonate with what they're saying, then that's where you build connection, that's where rapport is built, and that's where, you know, at the end if they say, hey, so we're, we now want to help do this with you, and if it makes sense and you're like, you know what, I really need that hand-holding, I, I want to take that next step, it's that, that person's choice, and you make sales right at the end. So, Webinar Marketing Funnel, there's no doubt that is the most efficient, and, you know, if you're a brick-and-mortar business, I understand, you know, maybe marketing content isn't going to be the best for you, um, but that's where you might do a coupon. That's where you might um, do a contest where you can drive in, in, you know, foot traffic to your business. So, the best lead magnet is no doubt a webinar, then from there, video marketing, because you can build connection by them being able to see you, then referral contest marketing or phone consultation where you're running an ad, solving a problem, and then the call to action is they enter their info, maybe fill out a survey, and then you give them a free phone consultation, and then you can convert a sale that way. So if you don't have a big, you know, advertising budget, you know, there's there's definitely options for you, um, for sure. But there's no doubt, webinar marketing funnel is going to work the best. So here's an example of just a very simple lead magnet. So we did a um, you know a six figure promotion when we did this. Um, so we started Life on Fire in July of 2013, and how cool is it? We started Life on Fire after I sold the business, and we came out we're like, all right, we're going to teach people, you know, Facebook advertising and share exactly how we've been doing it. Ran you know this um, ads on Facebook brought people to this opt-in page, 
and got leads, built up our email list for Life on Fire, took a brand new business, and did over six figures. Like, that's the playbook. We kept coming back to it. And so it was like, I mean, I had just built and sold a business, and now it's like, all right, well, I'm just going to build a new one, and I'm just going to do the same thing. I'm just going to run Facebook ads. I started at zero again, right? And so that's what's cool is that Life on Fire, I mean, as a brand, I, I, so when I sold the business, my slate was clean back at square one. And you know what? We're already deep into the multiple six figures as, a, as an organization. And our growth is Facebook advertising. Now, we've been very fortunate on the virtual summit. We've had some awesome affiliates that are you know, sharing what we're doing because they're really proud to be speakers on it. So if you came here from Brian Tracy or Gary Henderson or Ray Higdon or Jonathan Budd and, and, and you're friends with those guys or you're on their list and they sent you here, we, that's amazing. It's awesome. But for, for, for most of us entrepreneurs, it's not easy to get folks to, um, to, to cross-promote or to, um, to share you with everyone else. You know, it, it's just not easy. People are busy. So what I love is Facebook ads allows you to be self-sufficient on your own. And so here's what's really interesting. Um, these numbers are what we're putting up and what we tested in September for the virtual summit. So, um, you know, we tested the heck out of everything in September. And, you know, our... our opt-in page was converting at 54%. And if this sounds a little bit like gibberish, um, just bear with us. We'll, we'll break this stuff down. But our opt-in page with 54% opt-in rate, we're bringing in email leads for $2.10. The $97 business on fire bundle that I talked about in the beginning. So here's the thing. When someone shares that and people buy it um, and pay $97, all 100% of that goes to charity. When we run ads to it, um, we have to cover our ad costs. So, you know, we're spending $54 on ads in, to create a $97 bundle sale. And sweet, all the, the difference goes to goes to Pencils of Promise. And so, imagine, you put in $54, bucks, you are getting back 97 You know, we tested um, selling John Lee Dumas's course, The Podcaster's Paradise. Put in $147 on Facebook ads to make a $997 sale. You know, we had earnings, what's called earnings per clicks, earnings per click of over $10. So really, really exciting results. And so I'd like to bring Valerie on to walk through um, what's happening here with uh, with this ad. And then we're going to jump to, so Val, we'll go from here, and then we're going to have you walk us through making an ad in less than 10 minutes. Okay, sounds good. So this was one of the um, ads I used that got those results Nick was just talking about and how you lay this out is is so important first of all I want to talk you know the life on fire brand and Nick talked about the personal brand versus the company brand but what we did on life on fire was put Nick's face there so that makes it more personal so that's the first thing the second thing as you know you're reading down through there I'm super fired up to bring you this virtual summit with 24 of the most sought after speakers that's a very personal tone um, and in Nick's language that helps greatly you don't want it to read like you know a, a traditional ad where it's blah 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 you want it to be personal and in your personality and you know Nick uses a lot of smiley faces so that always helps too then, <laughs> then the um, I'm a little cheesy sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> You're always smiling anyway, so that's what it's all about. Um, and then the the colors that were chosen for the branding for the virtual summit, that orange really pops, so that helps too. But one thing you have to keep in mind is the 20% text on images when you run ads. Facebook will deny your your ad if you have more than 20% text, so you have to pay attention to that and watch that and then down below you see where I have another headline free event um, and what it is so I'm telling what it is what you're gonna get and how to get it and again saying it's with Nick Unsworth the thing with this particular style ad it's called a link share ad so anywhere within that picture the headline the description or the link below anywhere they click in there it's going to take them to the landing page so they can put in their name and email address and I've tested and tested and tested um, various different 
styles types of ads and this one still far outperforms all the others when you're tracking those conversions especially for leads registrations like we're talking about you get more leads and registrations at a cheaper cost when you do this uh, style link share ad Awesome, and I think what's going to be so cool is for you um, to show exactly how you do that. Because what I love is that um, Valerie's going to be breaking down. Just imagine that we run at this point. We now run thousands and thousands of dollars through Facebook ads. And what's so cool is that you guys are going to in just a couple minutes. You guys are going to get the exact playbook on what is working so well for us. And this stuff changes all the time. And this technique alone of just setting up the Facebook ads in this way and, and there's a couple key buttons to push in the right places and she's going to walk you through that. So uh, we're going to jump to that. Yeah, yeah well, while you're still on this slide, uh, I want to point out too, you know, the 976 likes, the 73 comments and 120 shares, of, of course at this point in time it's much, much greater than that. But the point being, when you see those types of numbers, it's that social proof you were talking about with page likes. The same thing applies to a post. People see 976 people liking this post and it makes them interested. They want to know what it's about. So when you can start clicking numbers up like that, that, um, it, it just propels your ad even further. Awesome. I love it. I love it. And so this is just an example of um, what happens once they click on that ad, then they would mm -hmm. land on this page. And this probably is very familiar for you guys. Um, but you know, this is this is just the actual opt-in page. And so Val, just any insights about this and how you make it congruent to the ad? Sure. So you notice the color, um, the branding, all of that needs to be congruent from the ad to the landing page. The absolute worst thing you can do is take somebody to a landing page that has nothing to do with what they thought the ad was talking about or that it looks way different. When it looks different, people, they're like, oh, what's going on here? Is this spam, scam? What's happening? Um, but when you keep it congruent, it makes people feel comfortable. They, they feel like they're in the right place, you know, they're not being led astray. And the other thing is that the language is congruent, that what you said was going to happen in the ad happened. And then they feel comfortable enough to take that next step, which in this case would be click on the button that says get free access and they would put in their name and email address. Awesome. Okay, great. Cool. And um, so I think on this slide, would you rather uh, me give you the screen or do you want to talk through anything here? Um, let's see. Well, no, just um, how about I take the screen yep, and let's do it. we'll build an ad. And awesome. I will do that right now. All right. So Valerie Shoopman is going to break down making an ad. And what I love is not only, like, it's so cool that literally can come together in 10 minutes and just really make sure that guys, I mean, take notes on this because even just the setup of these ads, it can dramatically change your effectiveness with your ads. And I mean, if, you know, there's just, there's a few key things and if you don't know, you don't know. And for some people, they do run ads and you can lose money. You know, that you, there's no doubt about it. So we're not sugarcoating that, but when you know the right things to do and you've got you know, someone like Valerie and myself to guide you through the right steps, you know, this can go from, you know, this can be a very profitable experience for you. So, um, so cool. So I can okay. see your screen, Val, and uh, I think we are good to go. Perfect. First thing I want to do is talk just briefly about conversion tracking before we start the ad because that's so important. I'm going to go ahead and open that up in a new window. That is how you tell what's working and what's not working is the conversion tracking pixels. And it's just as simple as clicking the green button, create a pixel. You choose your category. When I'm doing webinars or summits like this, I like registrations. You just click that. You give your pixel a name. I'm just going to do tests for right now and click create pixel and what it does is it will pop up a code for you and you just put this code on the thank you page or whatever page they hit after they've done the action so for example for the virtual summit we're talking about the thank you page they arrived on after they put in their name and email address that's where this code uh, went and then it will track the ads all the way through key key thing to have in place so you know what's working and what's not that way you can scale up what ads are working and pause out the ones that aren't that's how you get those low um, cost per registration cost per leads 
So that is most important to do first. And then I'm going to flip back here. If you just go to facebook.com forward slash ads forward slash manage, then you can click on this green button to create your ad. And here it's going to come up and they've changed this now to um, each campaign has an objective so at the onset you need to decide what your objective for that particular campaign is and I can tell you most most of the time I'm using this promote conversions on your website that is my all-time favorite and that's where those conversion tracking pixels come in and that's how I did that other ad now, I do want to say today we are just going to focus here in the ads manager dashboard and as we go along I'll point out some other things that are different in the power editor the power editor is a little little more difficult a little bit of a beast if you will um, but everyone can get in this ads manager dashboard and build these ads so I'm gonna do promote conversions on your website and then I need to put in a URL and what I always do I do this in notepad so I have it all ready and that way if something happens Facebook, uh, our, our technical gremlins happen, whatever happens, I don't have to remember what I did, um, and then I save those. So once you put in your URL, you can load that in, and I'll take a second here, and then the second box here, that's where you're going to pick the conversion tracking pixel that you had created. And for this particular one, I want it for the virtual summit registrations, so I put that in, and then I can say continue. Now what it's going to do, whatever page you put here, it's going to pull that image. You can use that image if you want. I would highly suggest that you customize an image for each ad. And if you um, customize an image, you can use Photoshop if you have and know how to use Photoshop. You could use Canva. You can also use GIMP, which is like a free Photoshop um, look-alike program if you will but the key thing is on this style of ad you want that image to be 1200 by 628 pixels that way it will show across all devices the right size the right proportion so again 1200 by 628 in this case I don't want to use this picture because it doesn't have text on here and, and it doesn't say really what I want it to say and actually what I'm going to do Nick is I'm going to build out a ad uh, that will be for your session on Thursday so Sweet. I'm uh, <laughs> so nice. I'm getting some work done while while we're showing so I'm I've got an image here and and it's that one and so I can upload that and I can get rid of this one and it popped in there I see that I left it a little long I didn't finish it up but it's alright we can still work with it um, so I've got the image and what I need to do now is choose the page so I will just go down and choose the life on fire page and then you can see it pops in here now it's only popping in the headline that it knew that it took from that URL and what text it could take so what I have is my little handy dandy uh, notepad here where I can copy and paste the headline and you'll see that it has a text count here so I have room for one more character and this is where this ads manager dashboard varies a little from the power editor in power editor you have the ability to have more characters here so you, you get a shortened version if you will here in the ads manager dashboard but then what I need to do is put in this text that's going to go where you would typically put your post text up there so I'll grab that and then just put that in here I'm just literally copying and pasting so then it will change that here and you'll notice right now we're on desktop newsfeed so this is what it will show up like in the desktop okay then we've got um, we can put extra text down here so if I click show advanced options here I can put that extra information in here it does only show up in the uh, newsfeed on desktop and I'll show you those differences we'll look at those in just a minute but I'm gonna go ahead and copy this and then paste it in here and you'll see it shows up in place here now here's another thing you can do 
this call to action button. You can leave it like this with no call to action button or you can have a call to action button in there. When they first came out with this I had um, a lot of success with it and then it seemed like everyone started doing it and I lost some of some of the newness and the, the um, uh, you know the newness of it is, is what I'm trying to say and then what I've seen now is people aren't using it as much and it's kind of going back and forth kind of like we always say Nick when other people are zigging you want to zag and when other people are zagging you want to zig so I try to watch what's going on in the news feed and then pull this in to test every once in a while for this example I'm gonna go ahead and test the sign up now so it will pop the sign up now button in there so essentially we have just created the ad you've got the post text up here and now anywhere anyone clicks on the picture on this headline on this description here where it is has the call to action right there it says click here now um, or on the lifeonfire.com URL anywhere in this area they click it's going to take them to the landing page that I had selected that I put up here in the URL so that's a key difference of when you just upload a photo you have to put the link in the the text and people have to do two clicks to actually get to the link and you're relying on them to to click all the way through where this style they just click once and they're automatically taken to where they um, where you want them to go so they can put in their name and email address and since we have this conversion tracking pixel in place up here that means it's going to track that on this ad so then we'll be able to see it, did this ad actually result in any conversions people registering for the event and if they did at what cost the other thing I want to show you is you know right here we're looking at the desktop news feed so you can also see what it looks like in mobile and this is a key thing um, especially in the power editor when you have room for more text up here this will truncate off and it'll have the read more so you always want to make sure of what it's looking like desktop and mobile and make sure your landing page looks good on mobile too if you're going to be paying to send, excuse me to send mobile traffic there then definitely you know you want to make sure that landing page is showing up good on mobile so um, they can have the best experience possible the other thing is this right column here now sometimes especially with the new right column format I can get ads to look good in all three places um, and and you notice when you do it like this you've got this social proof down here that's 43,910 people that are liking the life on fire page um, a lot of times I like to do this and I tell you right side ads are still my favorite you know on that one slide you had a Nick where you said as low as 16 cents um, for the opt-in on when we did the testing oh, in yeah. September that was from a right side ad and some of those lower cost on the bundle sales have been from right side ads as well so th they they are definitely up there in my favorite to do now what you can do you can leave them all together like this or you could remove the desktop and remove the mobile and just do a right column or you can add the the mobile and just remove the um, desktop so you're just doing mobile so my point is and when I removed the the right the others it lost the page I'll have to go back and get that but my point being you can control what platform you want your ad being shown on so that being said let me go grab it back so we see it I'm going to add these others in and then the next thing so that's all of our creative all done there oh it doesn't let me copy that again see this is what happens when you go back and forth and that's why you always want that notepad going on um, so you can do that okay so what we're going to do is then come down here what we're after now is the targeting so for the targeting there's there's so many ways you can go and I like to break it down into what I call you know hot warm and cold um, Facebook ad targeting the hot I consider your email list you can actually 
upload your email list as a custom audience and then you can be hitting those people in email and also hitting them in Facebook and that's going to help keep you top of mind help keep you you know in in the ballpark of them going oh I saw it there, and I saw it there, and I saw it there. I need to open it. Something big's going on. Um, I find all the time with the email that the conversions are higher at a lower cost. Another audience that can be hot or warm, depending on on your website and what's going on, is what's called the website custom audience. So you can actually put a snippet of code on your website and have Facebook automatically build you a custom audience off of all the people that come to your website. Now those people might be consuming your podcast or other content, so they're much um, much further along the like, know, and trust cycle than someone who has never heard of you before. And so a big difference there. So I consider those uh, hot to warm. And then also warm is your own Facebook page, uh, business page that you've been putting content out, answering questions, cultivating that relationship. So the custom audiences you would add in up here. Your pages you can add in down here on the connections. So any page you're uh, you know your business page so I can put life on fire right here and add that in you can see once you add something in it's going to give you what the potential reach is going to be okay and a lot of people get hung up on this reach what I like to do is separate it by targeting so I don't like to combine a whole bunch together for example if I combined people who um, liked life on fire and I combined our email list and I combined our website targeting list combined all of those I would have no idea which one was actually driving the conversions which one was driving the conversions at what cost and here's the thing that a lot of people don't really think about and that is you when you combine them like that you have no control over what percentage of the time Facebook is showing which one so for example in that example I just gave if we have the email custom audience the website custom audience and the life on fire fans Facebook or the the email custom audience may be converting the best at the lowest cost but Facebook may be only showing that audience the ad 20% of the time so you're losing out you're showing 80% of the time to the group that's not converting or converting at a higher cost does that make sense Nick yeah okay um, just making sure I wasn't, wasn't <laughs> rambling on too much there but I, I, that's just a point I like to make so I like to break it down so we have one specific targeting per ad you can see exactly what's working what's not working back to the potential reach what so it came up 19,400 great so that's what we have for this one I don't get hung up on the reach that being said I do like to keep it above a thousand because what I find is if it's below a thousand then it it's hard to get any traction it's hard to get Facebook to show it enough to see what type of results you're getting on the top end of that I like to keep it under about 200 50 200,000 because once you get bigger than that it's just such a large pool that you're you're reaching people that may or may not be interested so I always like to try to bring it down under there and so we talked about the different targeting the cold audience I didn't really talk about would be these interest here so when Nick was talking about your drilling down to your ideal target audience and what other Facebook pages they like that's where you can put this information in here like you might put in Mari Smith and then you would select her okay um, any of those pages that your your potential ideal client likes you would want to test those here and see how they convert for your particular offer for your particular thing for this this example and for going forward here I'm just gonna leave it as life on fire and then what you can do is you can give the ad set a name uh, I'm going to just type in Nick and on fire I want to put in speaker in there 
And then you can give it a budget, how much you're willing to pay per day for the particular ad. I like to start, in, if the budget's there, I like to start in the $20, $25 range to see how it's going. That way it gets enough traction and I can see what's going on. Be careful about scaling it up too quickly. Um, Facebook kind of frowns on that if you take it from, you know, ten dollars a day to two thousand dollars a day you know, depending on what your your uh, daily limit is but just be careful how fast you scale it up and then again it shows you based on your budget how many people you can be expected to reach and then here's the key thing down here we want to optimize for website conversions. You have these different choices here, but if we choose optimize for website conversions, we're using Facebook as a leveraging tool. We're using Facebook's data they've collected on people within your targeting that you selected, the people that have had a history of taking that conversion. So that's huge to be able to do that um, and work off of that data that Facebook has collected. And then that's it, Nick. I mean, that is the ad. The next thing to do is click place the order. Do you uh, have any oh. questions or have you, are there any questions coming in on the chat room? Yeah, so so basically, um, I, I think what's awesome is that you know that right there, and we will have uh, a replay for you guys too. And so, what's what's so interesting to me is that there's a handful of buttons that make so much difference. Even the way that you set up the ad for website conversions, if you set up the ad and you use a different style of an ad, that can dramatically change your effectiveness. So what's cool is that what, what Val walked through is exactly what's working so well right now in today's market. So you guys literally got that strategy, you got the playbook, you got the exact blueprint on how to set up the ads correctly, even set up the, the tracking, and that is so key because that is exactly what is, is um, you know generating such good results right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, jump back to my screen here, and so Val, I think so you can see my screen now. Um, and so guys, yep. if you do have questions, just feel free to uh, comment below. And uh, what we can do is we can refresh the page and ask uh, and get those questions answered for you in just a minute too. So um, so what I want to do is I want to share with you guys basically you know, how we can help you set your business and life on fire. And so the way we look at it is if you now know, if, if, if nothing else, if this um, you know, live session here um, gave you the um, understanding about Facebook advertising and what's possible, I want to ask you this question and I want you to think about what is the cost of inaction? And so, you know, if you think about it, in, in, and if we, if I start with this question, say, all right, well, what is it that you want? And what's interesting is that that is one of the toughest questions to answer. So if you think about it right now and I said to you, what do you want? And you're just like, um, I don't know. Like, you know, but if I literally said, what do you want? And you think about what is it that you want? And so for a lot of people, it, it comes down to, all right, well, I'd like to make 10000 per month in net revenue. Or, you know, I'd like to have more time freedom. Or, you know, I really would love to um, start a business so I don't have to, you know, work at this job I don't like. Or, But, like, if you think about what it is that you want in terms of, you know, with advertising or marketing, oftentimes it comes back to money. And so if you think about what that what it is that you want and what the, the monthly amount is, then you have to then look at where are you at now. So if you want to have ten thousand dollars per month as a net income, and maybe if you're only at five, well, there's a five thousand dollar gap. And so what's interesting, I was just hanging with Alex Mendoza and he always talks about what is the cost of inaction. You know, if 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 you saw this playbook and you're like, you know what, I want that. I want to go from five to ten grand a month, or I want to you know, put in the $2,500 and make back, you know, 20000 So whatever you think of what that is, then you've got to also think in your mind of, of what's the cost of not taking any action whatsoever. Well, you end up keep doing what you're doing. So the way I look at it is we've been so fortunate and so blessed that, I mean, and you heard my story of going from, um, you know, $50,000 in debt and then being in a spot where I just leveraged Facebook ads. You know, that's all I did. And in a short period of time, in 30 days, I got, you know, the speaking gig. 90 days, I broke six figures. Within two years, I sold the freaking business. And, you know, then I started at ground zero again, you know, just a, a year and a half ago. Life on Fire was, was, was nothing. It was invented then. And, you know, I had zero people on the email list. And boom, that was re started in the same thing again. I'm doing it right before your eyes again with Facebook marketing and advertising. And and you guys I'm sure, 
you've probably seen our ads. You know, you probably if you didn't come in through the ads, maybe you saw an email from us, but uh, most likely you've seen our ads. And so it's just this. I think of it almost as like this unfair advantage in business and to dominate your market, build your authority, make more money. And you know, when you have more, you have more flexibility. You can bring on help. You can delegate. You can outsource and live a life on fire. So. What, the way I look at it is we've had such blessings from this and we've helped so many entrepreneurs with Facebook advertising. Valerie and I have walked so many people through the, our course together. Um, we just want to share it up. We want to help more people with this and this is what we're passionate about. You know, I mean, ever since I lost that $30,000 in that new Perks card story in the, begin, in the beginning, that's one of my missions is I wanted to help other people and create success stories with this. So, um, so basically, if you look at it, you know, we've given you the playbook so there's no doubt you can take what it is that you saw here today. Um, Valerie running through the ad. You got my my training on ideal target market, how you can leverage that into your ads. You know, what are lead magnets and funnels and you know personal brand. You can take what you've you've got here and learn and you can you can run with it and implement it and do it yourself. Um, or you can do like what I did, which was I invested my way out of my problems. You know, I hired um, you know coaches. I went to events, even though I didn't have the cash to do it. I found a way. You know, and, and winners will always ultimately find a way. And so the other option B here on the screen that you're seeing is you can hire us to do it with you. And so we've cooked up an incredibly um, I really think of it as a really generous and just awesome offer for you guys. And we're, this is something that is um, uh, much more affordable than many people would think. And so we just really are looking at it and said, all right, if our goal is to create success stories, let's make this as accessible as possible. And we're going to give, and as you're going to see, we're going to give you our personal time. And we're going to literally lock arms with you and help you actually create the, your ads and help you optimize together. So today uh, we've got a very special uh, offer and gift and so we're going to share that with you guys. And so it's our live Facebook advertising coaching and, um, and it's completely done with you. And that is the key thing. It's you know working with Valerie and myself on a live call helping you get really clear. So if you're in that spot where you're overwhelmed or you're trying to figure out your target market, it's we're going, this is where we specialize. We're going to help you get clear in your target market, drill down. That's going to then convey into your ads. We're going to teach you how to set up your targeting. We're going to walk you through all this stuff together, uh, done with you. And so the outcome for you is to help you attract more likes, leads, ideal clients, and live that amazing lifestyle or life on fire. And, you know, why are we doing this live? It's because we know for a fact, if we just gave you guys the videos on this, it's not you know, we've had plenty of people that have purchased our, our uh, recordings after we've done a promotion like this and have gotten results. But the thing is that when you have us there live looking over your shoulder to help you implement the stuff it, and set up the ads and optimize, your your success ratio goes through the roof because we're, we've, we've been in this, we've helped a lot of people get results with Facebook marketing and we're there to do it with you. So you know, when there, you know, if you have a challenge that pops up, we're there to help you handle it. If you're overwhelmed, we're here to cut through the the clutter and make it simple for you. So, that is what's key about live is that we know that when we work with people live and we work with you one on one, it's like no, you know, it's, if you're think of like the Marines and the armies, it's like no, you know, man or no person left behind. I mean, that's how we look at it. Is our our goal, our desire is to help you create that success story fast. And so the question is, do you want to be one of them? You know, do you want to um, run Facebook ads and have our help and we'll do it with you. You know, have your brand be seen everywhere. Create that celebrity-like brand positioning in your niche. You know, be able to charge more for your services, attract more leads to your business so you don't have to sweat it out and you can just, you know, have more revenues. So that's the question. That's the decision. And, you know, we're going to help you increase your profits with this course. We're going to help you reduce hours work because if you can bring in more sales and you can make more revenue, you absolutely can delegate. And that is one of the cool things about what I'm able to do. You know, we helped one of our clients, you know, not only helped her make an additional over a million dollars, but she's brought on multiple other team members and outsourced contractors so that she has more time than she's ever had uh, in her business. And so that gives, you know, her time and it gives you time to work on things and have a business that has a purpose behind it, which is cool. So, um, so basically all the the things that you're going to get out of it is building your authority with the course. You're going to learn how to 
attract thousands of targeted likes, build up your email list, launch a product or a webinar or your lead magnet, and attract clients fast. So the end purpose is, you know, if you can get your numbers, and when you get your numbers to the point where you put in money on Facebook, we want to help you bring more money back out. If you put in a hundred bucks, we want to help you bring back out two hundred. We want to help you monetize this incredibly fast inside of thirty days. So we're giving four live business coaching training sessions. So that's, um, you know, that's four. Um, sessions we're going to go through some content we're going to go through content and teach you fast and still have time for Q&A at the end but it's totally live and you know we're super busy we know you're super busy and these are meant to be very focused so that um, you know we can have you get in get out get trained up get learn you know get your skills and we want you to walk away with we want you or your team member to have the skill of running Facebook ads so we're going to teach you fast on these you know live coaching sessions and we're gonna make sure it's gonna be dynamic it's you know we're going to be unmuting the line and we're gonna on the same page and knows what to do and is taking action through the course so this is um, workshop style as opposed to you know if you've ever had an experience of you know I know I personally have bought information products and I've never opened them or I bought information products and never did anything well what's cool is you know with Valerie and I working with you we're going to make sure and guarantee that you're gonna get results then we've got four live hot seat sections and this is what's super important because this is what's gonna stop the feeling of overwhelm this is going to allow us to literally help you on a one-on-one -on -one hot seat to get your questions answered fast you know I mean this is what you know I spend the majority of my time doing one-on-one -on -one calls all week you know Valerie spent a lot of her time you know doing some coaching calls as well along with running ads and so we're trained and we specialize in helping you cut through and figure out exactly what you should do for your market and I've done many multi six-figure product launches I'm working with Damon John from Shark Tank Joe Polish right now on a big launch we're doing November 20th we get Valerie and I we get to see a lot of things and we've got years of experience and a tremendous amount of knowledge on the subject and you know people pay 36,000 bucks a year for two 30-minute sessions a month with me and that's not to brag or to to sound cool that's just a to emphasize that you know we've got a lot of skills a lot of knowledge and we're gonna help you guys one-on-one -on, -one on the hot seats so you're also gonna get instant access to one of our previous um, uh, Facebook advertising trainings so that if you do want to dive in if you're an overachiever and you want to get ahead we can certainly give you access to that it's $997 value we also have a course um, which is called the six-figure Facebook marketer and the reason we designed this course is because a lot of people were saying, Nick, I want to do what you do, or Valerie, I want to do what you do. And um, and so this course actually talks to people how to become a Facebook marketing consultant or an expert. And, um, and this, so it, it's a different spin. So this may not, you know, if you're like, Nick, I just want more sales, cool. This Our course is going to be great for you. This particular bonus is if you want to be a Facebook consultant. And uh, we t teach you how to get clients and we teach you the whole process on how to build this style of a business and we've helped multiple people create six-figure businesses um, by being a Facebook consultant. You're also going to get resources, templates, copy, and contest rules and these are things that we've spent lots of money on that you can have at your fingertips and help you to become successful private Facebook group so that um, we've got a really thriving group which is great for networking it's high level the only people in that group are, are our clients and you know, we've got a lot of people that have done business together that form alliances joint venture partners so this is a really cool asset um, we're even throwing in tickets to our live event called ignite in December which is December 5 6 7 in San Diego so we're gonna hook you up with a ticket so as a recap we've got four live coaching sessions that's a $997 value for live hot seat sessions $997 value instant access to four Facebook advertising training videos 997 value instant access to the six-figure Facebook marketer $997 value resources templates and copy $297 value Facebook group I like to think priceless it's really hard to put a value on that um, then a complimentary ticket to ignite the total value is four thousand three hundred and eighty two bucks and so if you know um, how we roll with life on fire um, we're all about just giving way more value than what we're charging and so what's cool is we've got to also have a 30-day 
money back guarantee, no questions asked. Um, so you know, if if you don't get the results, if you if you don't make your money back inside of that 30 days with running ads, I mean that's our goal is to work with you and get this stuff implemented, and make it happen fast. This isn't, you know, let's run ads nine months later. This is get started. We're going to do the calls and we're going to help you implement right away. And our goal is success stories. You know, we we like putting up success stories of folks that are putting in a thousand, making five thousand back. You know, it's you know we that's what we that's what gets us fired up. So. We've got a 30-day, totally rock-solid money-back guarantee. We've got a great reputation in the industry, and our goal is always to over-deliver and make happy customers. So, 30-day money-back guarantee, and so um, you know, my my offer is to let us help add five figures to your bottom line. And uh, today, you can grab the course for 997 bucks. And so. The way I look at it is 997 bucks. It's an investment, you know, just like how I invested in, you know, in my education, my courses, and it totally spun my life around. You know, from 50 grand in debt to selling a business in two years, and we're just boom on the same pace with Life on Fire, multiple six-figure business right out of the gates. So, uh, 997 bucks. You can get all this, but <laughs> oh my God. I got a special little deal. Um, if you hop on board right now, um, you can actually hire Valerie and I to work with you over the shoulder, help you set all this stuff up, and uh, and do it live together. And that is just six hundred and ninety-seven dollars. So you can save an additional three hundred bucks by getting rolling right now. And we also have a two-payment option of just three hundred and ninety-seven. So the way I look at it is, you know. Make that decision if you want to get more leads, you want to build your authority, and you want the fast track. You know, from people that are, I mean, you know, Valerie and I, we are managing campaigns with, you know, one of the most incredible and greatest marketing experts of our time, Joe Polish, and Damon John, a celebrity from Shark Tank. Um, it, you know, that, it, that's crazy, and you know, you're going to get that same team on your team um, with eight live sessions where we're working with you one on one. So um, that is just for 697 bucks. We're making it easy for you. First 10 people, we're going to throw in a course, Video Marketing A to Z, which is about how to get videos ranked on the first page of Google. Did this with Maria Andros, and we're also going to throw in our Insiders Club, which is additional weekly group calls as well. And so that's just for the first 10. So, you know, if you're thinking about it right now, I want you to think in your mind of, you know, just making that decision. You know, if it's for you, make that decision, jump on board. Um, this offer isn't going to be around long. So um, make that decision, you know, grab your credit card and just say, you know what? If you want to get those sales, you want to get to that next spot. If there's been, you know, if you need more cash flow in your business, then I mean, just go for it. Make it happen now. And you know, I also want you to think of, you know, what happens if you don't do it. You know, how much longer do you want to, you know, if your business, if if you need more revenue and you need more leads, or you're you're stumbling or you're struggling with that, you know, what's the cost of inaction? What's the cost of not doing anything right now? You know, and that's another really important question to think about. And you know, we're that solution. You know, and we're going to help you live, live one on one on our group calls together, which is really key. So we're going to help ensure that you're successful and you, that you guys make money with this. So the next step, I'm going to put a link on the screen. All you have to do is go to the link and purchase today. Get this awesome discount and we'll totally um, get you all the bonuses and then we'll also hop on the live calls and get started right away. So the link is lifeonfire.com slash Facebook. So make that decision. Take fast action. We know that the folks who take the fastest action usually have the best success stories. And um, so it's just lifeonfire.com slash Facebook. And the coupon code is SAVE300. And so this is a very special offer. And just decide you know, now and go to lifeonfire.com slash Facebook and we can hook you guys up, get you all scheduled and dialed in for our live calls together in the hot seats. So we're very excited. It is our mission, our goal to help you become our next success story. And uh, and so all you have to do is make that decision and go now to lifeonfire.com slash Facebook. And I'd like to bring Valerie Shootman back on the line and so so you guys can hear why you know why Valerie, why you're fired up about this course. Oh Nick, I am so fired up because I love teaching Facebook ads. Absolutely love it. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Well, um, and so, and and tell us about just um, as far as 
you know, working with you, right, and optimizing ads, how can you help someone optimize their ads, and what, what are the kinds of things that you can do when you've got someone live where you can see their ads and what can happen, or, or maybe walk us through what happened with, with Damon John's company and how fast you're able to, you know, because it's kind of crazy if you think of, you know, how much can they do, you know, on a live one-hour call, and what's possible with some of this uh, over-the-shoulder coaching. Exactly. Um, you know, with Damon John's team member, I it was after the fact they had ran some ads to a webinar, and then I came in after the fact and looked at the results, and then tweaked it and said, "Okay, so you're putting podcast here, but it's not really a podcast." And that was, you know, like on the landing page and in the ad copy, and then looking at the congruency, like I talked about, from the ad to the landing page, and that's just the funnel and the setup. Then going into um, doing a screen share and actually going into their ads um, back in, their Facebook ads back in and looking at the targeting. For example, one of the ads he had set up was over 2 million for the potential reach for the targeting audience, which was way high. Um, of course, didn't have conversion tracking pixels in place, so really wasn't being able to track that. Um, you know, all those types of things. I've seen so many ads, built so many ads, and my background, my tech back background, I did tons of troubleshooting. So that comes to me so instantly to be able to look at something and instantly see why it's not working, what would work, what tweaks you need to make. And I think that's one of the most valuable things to be able to offer that to people in a very short time frame and then get them off and running and be successful. I love it. I love it. And I think I mean it just what's so cool is I don't I don't personally know of anyone that is doing any type of this live over the shoulder uh, coaching anywhere near this price point, which is awesome. And, and that and I think that speaks to just our desire to create success stories with this and also to help to share, you know, the strategy and the things that we've learned that have helped us build this entire business. And it's like you know, there's people that ask, you know, if um, if everything was taken away and you had to rebuild, you know, what would you do? And it's, I mean, there is lots of ways to get customers, but out of every possible scenario in how to get customers, I go back and I choose Facebook advertising every single time because it's scalable. It's scalable. It can be great for time. You can just do, one, you know, one webinar a week or one webinar a month, and you know that to me is where the leverage is. And the great thing is that you can ramp that up. We've seen it with our clients, and you know, it's just if there was another form of traffic that was better or, or more scalable than this, then. Valerie and I, we'd be doing it. <laughs> you know, if, if we could advertise on Twitter and, it, and if it worked better and the numbers were better, we'd do that. If YouTube is better, we would do that. But the reality is there is no better place to buy media and to grow your business than Facebook. And now when that changes, you can you can you can certainly bet that we're gonna change with the times, you know, but this is the uh, most profitable place to advertise. And it's such a flip. It's like, you know, the story from two thousand eight of losing thirty thousand bucks in making two hundred eighty dollars versus now it's like you know our numbers of you know putting in it was one hundred forty seven bucks to make a nine hundred ninety seven dollar podcast you know course sale you know so that's that's what's exciting so um, in working with us you know we're going to literally guarantee your success you know and success and happiness with us and we'll um, we're gonna start by doing the live sessions we're gonna drill down into strategy because everything comes down to two things it's strategy and then your Facebook ad optimization on the strategy side you know, we're gonna look at I'm gonna drill down into your target market your ideal target market we're going to you know have that that one-on-one -on -one conversation to make sure that you know we're clear on exactly where you're targeting who you're targeting what does your offer look like you know what's the copy and the headline on your lead magnet you know, what is the, the challenge or frustration that your customer has and how do you market to that? Well, you know, we're, we're talking about Facebook advertising consulting right now, but on these lines, we're going to be helping you, you know, with, with copy ideas. We're going to be helping you with graphic design resources. I mean, all kinds of different things are come up when you're doing Facebook ads. And so there's a lot more than just the, the ads. So whatever it is that you need where your business is, odds are that we've had a client in a similar scenario, been doing this for you know, for over 
four years and um, and just been very, very heavy with the client work and just worked with lots and lots of people. So we're here to help guarantee and make sure that you guys are successful. So um, next thing to do is if you haven't already, just decide now and if it's if it's if there's something holding you back, um, feel free to just reach out on the comments, ask any questions there. You can always email support at lifeonfire.com. So if there's a question that we haven't answered, if there's something that's holding you back but you want to do it, um, then just email support at lifeonfire.com and we will get that answered as fast as we can for you. And just a quick recap, as far as what you're getting is the four focused live coaching sessions. So we're going to have a little bit of content, we're going to teach, and then we're going to answer any questions that you have. And so from there we're going to do the live hot seat sessions. And the cool thing about that is it's one-on-one -on -one hot seats in a group setting. So you're going to be able to um, get your questions answered, you're going to have myself and Valerie, and we're going to be able to drill down and and help you take something that can be overwhelming like Facebook ads and make it simple. Then we're going to give you instant access to our Facebook ad course that we've already done many times in the past, our six-figure Facebook marketing course, the resource templates private Facebook group, take it to our event. And for those first 10, um, we've got our video marketing A to Z course that is all about how to get videos ranked on the first page of Google with Marie Andros and her training there. And then our weekly group calls, which is called the Insiders Club as well. So lifeonfire.com slash Facebook is uh, where it's at. Be sure to use the coupon code SAVE300 bucks, or excuse me, SAVE300 and we're giving this all away right now for six hundred and ninety seven dollars or the two payments and so um, so this is we're just trying to make it super accessible for you guys and uh, if it's right for you hop on board Val anything before we jump uh, I just want to go back to those hot seats you were talking about I think one of the most powerful things not only do you get to be in a hot seat yourself but you get to hear other people in those hot seats so that really gives you ideas how you can apply different scenarios to your own business so it, it almost like amplifies your learning experience yeah and it's really interesting because sometimes when we're in the hot seat, it's like you can't see, um, mm -hmm. you know, the light at the end of the tunnel sometimes. And because we're in, when you're in, it's so it's so interesting when you're working on someone else's business. It's so easy, right? <laughs> but when you're <laughs> when it's your own business, you can't see it, you know. And and what really what happens that's really special. And Valerie and I, we we do this in person at mastermind events. We do this on the phone like this, uh, on webinars. But when you hear other people and you hear how we we work through the challenges you get to understand the thought process behind this for someone else and it creates this really incredible learning experience that you apply to your own business. And what's interesting is that when someone, we're doing the hot seat and if someone has that block and they're like, oh, you know, like, and, and, they're, and they just, they don't seem to get it. What's funny is that for everyone else, everyone else sees and hears it too. And then so that what happens is after a couple of these happen, when you're in the hot seat, it's like, oh shoot, does everyone else get it except for me? And then we kind of expand your mind. And so there really is a good amount of mindset um, training that happens through this because we're going to help you think and play bigger. You know, part of doing Facebook ads, there's some expansion that happens to your brain and to your mind. You know, the client that I'm referring to that had never done more than a half a million dollars in her business. You know what happened when I sat down with her? I expanded her mind. I got her to think bigger. That's one of the things that people always say about me. It's like, Nick, you just think so dang big. It's like this summit. The summit is big. The summit's too freaking big. It's too big that we crash the server. You know, but like, I can't help it. Like, that's just why I'm, how I'm wired. I just, I want the most for people. I, as a business coach, it's my job. It's my passion to look at someone and to pull out and say, you're just, you're not, you're, you know, like there's to unlock the potential and help them realize that they could actually be playing a much bigger game than they're currently playing. And so what's cool is that, you know, in that example with, with our client, she had never done more than a half a million dollars. Now, for many, you know, for, you know, if you're listening, you, you might think, well, half a million dollars isn't so bad, right? She had an amazing business, right? But I knew that by running Facebook ads and with the right webinars and then optimizing it together, optimizing the process, I knew that there was a seven-figure business. So what I did is I first got her to realize that. I got her to believe that that was possible 
And that happened in January. And sure enough, right after that, we started the plan. We then implemented the strategy, ran Facebook ads. She then got that off her plate. She hired great suppliers. You know, Shane and Ryan, these guys are awesome at Facebook ads. And she took that off her plate. They started running Facebook ads. We started optimizing webinars. Next thing you know, you know, she's just making more revenue than she's ever made, you know, and able to literally break seven figures and she didn't just double her business it actually tripled her business and when you think about it like that's insane like out of nowhere like you know revenues have been the same the same the same year after year after year after year and then they freaking tripled I mean if we really just think about that it's it's absolutely crazy to just triple a business now obviously this is our one of our best success stories but the reason I'm sharing that is because all that happened is it came down to running Facebook ads, driving the right targeted traffic, and then optimizing the process. It wasn't just, you know, she did one webinar and she threw in the towel. It's, it's you know, if you look at it and say, wow, what Nick and Valerie showed me here today, I can see how I can run ads and I can grow my email list and I can build my authority and I can make more sales, make more money. Well, that process is, it starts to become a lot of fun when you see the additional revenue coming in. And then why not just continue to optimize that? You know, with Valerie and I, we've got eight sessions together. We're going to help you get clear, get this stuff set up, then run ads. You're going to have ads running on your ad campaign manager that when we move on, you know, when the, the whole course is done, you guys can keep running the ads and keep going, you know, and the, our, our job is to help optimize these things, get you set up for success so that at the end of the whole course, you guys are good to go and you, you keep doing it, you know, keep driving revenue, keep bringing it in. So, uh, so we're, we're excited as you can tell. Um, so jump on board with us. We're going to have a, it's going to be a small group. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be intimate where we're going to be able to really help you conquer Facebook ads together. So lifeonfire.com slash Facebook. Hop on board. Let's crush this thing together and be sure to use coupon code SAVE300. Valerie Shootman, a.k.a. Shoop, awesome hanging with you as always. And guys, have a great rest of your day and definitely let us know if you have any questions. Support at lifeonfire.com. We are here to help. Our mission with Life on Fire is to help you live a life on fire and help you make more money with Facebook ads. So hop on board. Val, any final words before we, do, we, we head out? I was just going to say thanks for having me on and you know I love talking Facebook and would love to to help everyone take their campaigns to the next level. Awesome. Well, you guys have a great great rest of your day and uh, we'll catch up with you real soon on the next Life on Fire virtual summit session. See you guys. Cheers. Bye.